Thank you. Hey, you're supposed to hold the door open for me too, buddy. No, because, because it was stuck. Here, would you want to film me? Can you film me? Film mommy. Point it at mommy. What do you think? Do you like my outfit? I can see your face. Do you like my clothes uh, thing? Yes. Yeah. Okay, come on. We're back again. Say we're back again. Say I didn't come yesterday. We're back to say bad words. We're not back to say bad words. We're back to return our puffs that didn't work out. That's what we're here for. These puffs. Right here, we're gonna return these. We have a child with us this time, so let's see how this goes. So, the update is we're able to return it and we can have store credit or we can have money back, but I mean, I guess we don't really need anything, but it's what it sounds like. I feel like I can always find things that I need. You know? You know. Careful, 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 because if you break it, if you break it, you have to pay for it. Do you have money? You have money? Where's your money? I have money, but I'm not going to give you. If I want to what? I don't want them. It's comfortable. Cheese! Oh! Um, <laughs> don't need your glasses when out in the sun, silly. That's true, okay. Take it off. <laughs> what did you get there? This is the drying rack that I wanted to get. Oh, wow, I didn't have it. So you can use our glasses on it? Yeah, but they don't have a clear one. Oh wow, that's cool. Yeah. Where's that from? Boon? Boon? See if you can order those online. You can, but they're like heavy to ship, you know? Huh. That's just taking forever now. We came to buy a booster seat, but she deviated from the plan again. I can't complain. I'm just chilling here. I got drying stuff. You got what? I got this one for behind the sink. Four behind. And then you can put like this in it, like the bottle cleaner. And then this, like flour, and it can hold sponges. Yay! Damn. You know what? You're very efficient. Thank you. And I think that's a thing, like, to tell a woman, you're efficient is better than I love you. Okay. Right? You're okay. so efficient, babe. Thanks, babe. Do your thing, girl. <laughs> Ahmed, you got us lost. We're not lost. The avenue's parking lot is extremely confusing. You looking mighty cute in your new booster seat, homie. Can I help you out? Yeah, it's a tractor or, yeah, it's a tractor. So we've just gotten this package and it says that it's from Queen Rania of Jordan. And she's just recently done a collaboration with Ikea for the refugees in Jordan and then handiwork from women in Jordan. So we're going to open it up and see what it is. So this says, in this box is a selection of carefully and skillfully crafted products by Jordanian women and Syrian refugee artisans in Jordan. Each piece tells a story of dignity and pride of strong and determined women stitching together a more hopeful future for themselves and their families. The products are a result of a collaboration between the Jordan River Foundation and IKEA that claims to create long-term and sustainable change by creating job opportunities in vulnerable communities. Chaired by Her Majesty Queen Rania and Abdullah. So that's what we're opening. First things first, there are three notebooks. Jordan River, they're just empty notebooks. My name, in case you forget it. 
These are handmade by social entrepreneurs and I'm assuming that this is the same as well, which is really nice. It has like Velcro, I need to find a way to use it. In here, These are the same, I think this is a smaller one. It's probably a set of three. And then the largest piece is this. That's so cute. Oh, it's so nice. It's a beautiful pillow. I love the color. Thank you guys so much. This is such a great initiative, guys. So Thank if you, you. have this, um, and you have it at your fingertips and you're able to uh, participate and buy it, then definitely do. So this is the stuff that we bought today. We've set it up, this is our little kitchen. But this is the Boone drying rack and then the rack for all of the brushes and things. And I bought this brush today. And then this is a soap dispenser and a bunch of stuff that we've been needing and I'm just, again, never here long enough to do it. So I did it! We're trying to get these shelves hung. All together in this tiny yeah. little bathroom. Okay, hmm. Yola, now you're gonna push on it. You ready? Yola, push up. You ready? Make sure it's straight, yeah? Right. This is my pride and joy. Have a nice poop. Okay. Okay. Hey guys, it's been kind of a weird vlog today because we kind of did the same thing as yesterday and I felt like we were gonna bore you so we just didn't keep it, I don't know, just not that interesting today I suppose because we were running around for house things and then Fultold wasn't interesting because we got takeout because I didn't have time to cook so I thought I would show you our front entryway as the closing to this vlog since we're kind of showing you all of the stuff that we're doing for the house anyway. This is a gate that I had built by our carpenter and installed so the kids don't go upstairs because we live in a uh, duplex, so we're on two floors. Uh, right now, Noah is asleep, as you can see on his baby monitor, I think. This is my favorite baby monitor, so if you guys have kids, I recommend it. Motorola is the best. Uh, these candles are from Bath & Body Works. This is just IKEA. These are special candles that we only light when we have like events or special guests or things like that because they're quite pricey as far as candles go. Um, and then these are just felt from West Elm and this is something from IKEA. This was a gift. I think they're from Zada Home. This is from IKEA as well. It's the new collection so you'll find that in um, in stores now and it's just it's a USB thing and they turn on and off and it's plastic so we don't worry about all of those breaking and the running theme in our house for absolutely everything is that it can't really be breakable and we can't get emotionally attached to it because we have children and it's pointless pointless to be emotionally attached to things when you have kids so that's it that's all for us today guys and uh, we'll see you tomorrow and we'll show you around the house a little bit more